Hey, Van Lopes here from Off the Block, and the NCAA Volleyball Committee released the Final Four, and very interesting on some of the moves. The four teams to make it. We knew three coming into the day as BYU, Penn State, and Loyola had gotten the automatic bids, and the at-large bid, well, that went to UC Irvine. The Anteaters were able to beat out Long Beach State to get the number two seed, and will play the number three seed, Loyola, in the semifinals. The other semifinal pairing is going to be the number Number one seed BYU and they're going to play the number four seed Penn State. Now two things that stand out for me with this selection committee is one very interesting that UC Irvine was going to get the at large. I know that there was some talk that Long Beach State should have gotten it because the 49ers got a conference tournament victory against the Anteaters. However you have to look at the entire body of work and UC Irvine when you break down the criteria there were eight pieces of criteria the selection committee uses determine the at-large bid head-to-head -head against Long Beach State. The Anteaters ha held five of the categories, including head-to-head -head with three regular season victories against Long Beach State. So it made sense that the Anteaters were able to get the at-large bid. But the big surprise for me is that Loyola jumped ahead of Penn State to get the number three seed. In the off-the-block projections, we had, Penn, we had Penn State as number three, Loyola as the four and kind of interesting here on how Loyola was able to get one of the factors that could have played in was the was the amount of teams that the selection committee was considering. If the selection committee included teams under consideration such as Ball State and Lewis, that would have boosted Loyola's quality of wins that would have put them ahead of Penn State and have gotten them the number three seed. So very interesting selection Sunday. It's going to be very exciting as the NCAA tournament is here with the semifinals taking place on Thursday. And for all your volleyball coverage leading up to the Final Four, you're going to want to go to offtheblockblog.com.